Solar photovoltaic is popular because it doesn't pollute the air or water during its electricity production, and it relies on sunlight, which is renewable. The world has been rapidly installing solar panels and has doubled capacity between 2012 and 2015. But one question governments around the world are asking is, what do we do with all the waste? Solar panels are useful for 20 to 25 years and then end up like this. Used solar panels are a form of electronics waste, which is emerging as an environmental and health disaster around the world. Impoverished people scavenge e-waste dumps for valuable copper. They burn the e-waste to expose the copper which they can sell, but the plastic in the e-waste releases toxic fumes known to cause cancer and birth defects. They also expose themselves to toxic metals like lead, chromium, and cadmium, which can damage their nerves, brains, and shorten their lifespans. These toxic metals can leach out of landfills and poison water supplies like in Giyu, China. Now, people worry more about nuclear waste than solar waste. Nuclear waste is just used nuclear fuel. It's solid and in the shape of a rod. Fresh waste is stored in a pool. Over 10 to 20 years, the spent fuel assembly cools down and becomes safe enough to be transferred into dry casks and stored, where plant workers inspect them every day. By handling and storing nuclear waste in this way, no one has ever been harmed by the radiation or toxicity of the spent fuel. How do solar and nuclear waste compare in volume? Solar panels last about 25 years, so let's look at the amount of nuclear waste in that time. If you took all nuclear waste from the entire world starting in 2016 and stacked it on a football field, it would be as tall as the Leaning Tower of Pisa. If solar provided the same amount of electricity as nuclear did in 2016, the resulting solar waste stack would be 300 times as tall as Pisa, about twice as high as Mount Everest, and that doesn't even take into account the issue of batteries. Bottom line, the solar industry needs to recycle, or at least contain used panels. Nuclear power plants have been doing so for over 50 years. Why shouldn't solar do the same?